Yeah, that sheriff's deputy is lucky to be alive. She was going to help a stranded driver. She parked her car a safe distance back. As she approached that stranded vehicle, another car came through, split the gap, nearly hitting her. It spun this car out. One of at least two accidents today caused by drivers going too fast for conditions. This video around 9.30 this morning shows a deputy helping out a woman in a stalled car on US 45 near Burleigh. Then out of nowhere, another car slams into this one, nearly hitting the deputy. The driver of the stalled car is ejected. Minutes later, deputies are escorting the woman to a squad car out of harm's way. She suffered serious injuries to her face. Just a few hours later at 73rd and Silver Spring, it happens again. As a county worker was helping a stranded driver that was stuck in a snowdrift, attempting to shovel her car out. The next car came, then I heard boom, and I looked up and... He was going down, and the other car was up on the bank, too, and it, it was just um, just a freak accident. Missy Pierce says the worker was pinned between the two cars. She called for help and stayed with him until the ambulance arrived. He's trying to get up, so I told him to lay down. I told him to breathe slowly. I told him to count so he could stay alert. Now the driver in the freeway crash is facing multiple charges. As for the one that hit the county worker, they were cited for going too fast for conditions. County Executive Chris Abley says this needs to be a wake-up call for people to slow down. In Milwaukee, Ben Hutchison, WISN 12 News.